hi everyone welcome back to keto blogging and today in this video i will show you how you can add a timeline like this to your blogger website so as you can see that we have step one step two step three and we have total of seven steps so you can add as many steps as you want and you can add a heading you can add a paragraphs or you can insert a table or you can insert an image in this timeline so that it will be interactive for the users and it will be improving the user experience on your website so let's check how you can add this timeline feature to your blogger website so for this we are going to log in to our blogger dashboard and let me create a new post here now here you need to copy a code like this so i will provide the link of this code in the description so just follow the video as i am showing here so first of all you need to switch to the html view so let me add a title timeline and let me paste that code here and here you need to first change the content so here we have this step one that is a heading and then we have a paragraph added here and we have added a link on this paragraph as well so let me quickly publish this and check how it looks in our blogger website now let me click on here and as you can see that this is how the timeline looks like we have a border and we have a background image so if you don't want that border then you can also quickly remove that let's click on here now scroll down to the css section and here you will see this option border just remove it and you can also remove the padding and background so let me quickly remove all these three values now let me hit update now let me refresh it now it will show a clean timeline like this now if you want to add an image on this step one then you can also do that so for this just scroll up and as you can see that this is the step one here with the list element so we need to insert it here in a image so for this what i can do is i will hit enter here and i will click on image or i can upload a image from my computer or i will select an existing image so let's click on blogger here let me select this image and i will click on insert now i will select extra large click on ok and as you can see that we have inserted an image url here so let me hit update let's go to the timeline and let's refresh it and as you can see that we have inserted an image on the timeline so this is how you can add any element in the timeline and make it looks interactive so you can also further customize the color of this timeline so as you can see that we have added a green background so let's click on here click on inspect and let me click on here click on before and here you will see the background color 059862 so let's click on here scroll down to the css section and here you will find the background color 059862 so you can change the hex color here and you can change the hex code color for that bar as well so let, suppose let me change it to a red color so let me click on here and let me click on red and let me copy the color code so this color code is for this background and the second color code is for the bar so let me change this two color code value here and let me change it here as well now let me update it now let me refresh this page and as you can see that we have successfully changed our timeline color like this so you can further customize the look and feel of this timeline and customize it according to your website so i hope you have learned how to add a timeline like this to your blogger website and how you can add more timeline suppose you want to add a eighth number here so all i have to do is go to edit and search for the list element just copy the list here and let's hit enter and let's duplicate it and you can make it step 8 like this and you can change the content here and let me update it let me refresh it and you can see that we have added a step 8 like this so it will automatically increase the count value here 
so this is how you can add a timeline feature and if you found this video helpful then make sure to hit the like button and if you want me to make more such videos then make sure to hit the subscribe button so that you will get updates for our upcoming videos and don't forget to join our whatsapp channel where you will get timely updates of our videos blog post so make sure to join that as well and i will see you in the next one bye bye